right now we're going to talk about something intriguing that you can watch. This is MTV's Catfish, the TV show. They have some new episodes dropping right now. Let's learn more about it. MTV's hit series Catfish, the TV show, is back with all new episodes and all new deceivers. Today I'm catching up with executive producer and host Neve Shulman and co-host Kemi Crawford. Thank you both of you for being here. Thank you. So, Neve, I'm, let's start with you. Tell me more about these new episodes. Well, like every uh, season of Catfish, each story is very different from the other. And, and in many cases, each season is different. And I think, especially right now, because we're, we're coming out of the pandemic and so many of these episodes are, are sort of based in an experience that was so specific to this pandemic, uh, there really are different types of stories and different types of connections that were made. And like you said, different types of deceptions that we're discovering. So it's, it's pretty wild. And it can't mean the pandemic had quite an effect on the show. Tell me more about what the result was. Yeah, I mean, so we've been filming these episodes for a year now, which is crazy to think about. Um, and we started pretty much at the start of the pandemic last year. Um, and over time, we've changed with the pandemic. You know, we went from filming completely remotely at home to now, and even I are actually able to film together in our office now that things have opened up a little bit. And, you know, it's awesome and amazing, but we're also seeing more excuses related to the pandemic from these catfish. You know, I can't meet up with you because I'm too afraid. I don't want to catch COVID. And, you know, now that things are opening up, they're going to have to change their excuses around a little bit or come clean. And uh, it's just becoming more and more interesting every step of the way. And Neve, did more people find themselves being catfished over this past year? I think so, for sure. And, and, I, and I, as I kind of continue to think about it, I, I feel as though we're going to see more and more stories that start kind of popping into our inbox in the coming months from relationships that started in the last year. And obviously, you know, were impeded by the pandemic in terms of meeting in person. But now as things become, you know, more open, I think a lot of people are gonna be writing in saying, well, you know, we didn't meet up this last year because of the pandemic, but now it's been a few months and we're both vaccinated and I just don't understand why they can't meet me. And I think we're gonna to start to really see an influx of stories that, that started and existed over the course of the last year. So that'll be interesting to see. And Kemi, when someone tunes in, what will they expect to see out of the interactions with you and with Neve and with the individuals that you're working with on the show? Um, the unexpected every time. Even if you've seen every single episode of this show from the beginning, you will still find something brand new every single time. Um, this season, we start off with a couple who met on Pornhub, and that was the first time that that's ever happened. You know, now we have different things like OnlyFans and TikTok and all these different platforms that people can use to, you know, express themselves and to meet people. So um, we're constantly evolving with the times and all the different apps that that come into play. So you can you can always expect something new and fresh on Catfish. That's for sure. Well, Neve and Cami, thank you so much for joining us today. Looking forward to watching these all new episodes. It's been really interesting talking with you both and finding out the impact of the pandemic on your show and how it's changed things in that whole world. Catfish, the TV show, premieres Tuesday, May 4th at 9 p.m. Eastern time on MTV. Thanks for being here. Thank, thank you. you.